more verse. interesting because many of us have uh, grown up in church or we haven't, but regardless, you know what Christmas is about. You've been in Christmas celebration for your whole life. You know, at a certain point when you do something enough times, it sort of becomes redundant or it feels like it's no longer special. And, you know, our heart for this season is very simple. Christmas is something we celebrate each and every year. Christmas is something that we know forwards and backwards. Christmas is something that's ingrained into the fiber of what we believe. And yet we believe that God wants to remind us of the love that he has for us in this season in a brand new way. Church, when we step into this Christmas season, I don't know if it's gonna be us reinventing what Christmas means, but I genuinely believe that we are going to lean so firmly into what the Bible says about Christmas that we're going to walk out with a new understanding of the depths of the love that God has poured out for us. Church, would you do me a favor? Could we pray to prepare our hearts for what God's gonna do this month together? Lord, we're so thankful for all that you've been doing here, Father. Lord, as we move into the Christmas season, this special and sacred Christmas season, Father, would you remind us what this is all about, Lord? Can we begin to pull back all the distractions, Lord? Can we begin to remove all the things that are gonna hinder us from becoming as close as we can to you, God? Lord, I pray in this season that you give us a remembrance of who you are, of your love, of the sacrifice that you've made by sending your son to live here, Father. I pray that in this Christmas season, we can celebrate his birth and understanding of what it means, God. Lord, I pray for every single heart, for every single soul, of every single person in this room, Lord. Can we be prepared for what you're gonna pour out for us over these next last Sundays of the year, God? We're excited to hear from you, Lord. We're excited to be here as a community and we're excited and expecting to receive. Lord, we love you and we thank you and in your mighty name, all of God's people said, amen. Hey, can you just give it up?